G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Joe Woodle, and welcome back to 7 Days, and welcome back to Demolishers Only. In fact, it's more than that, welcome back to Napalm Demolishers Only, where everything is explosive, everything is burning, and we are coming back today because tonight is Horde night. I've spent the last night, or since we, left, since we left off last episode, just going through and looting almost all of this building. I've still got the main loot to go. But I've actually found some pretty decent stuff. I found a wire tool, which I need, because I need to make myself the, um, watch my cause. You anymore, actually, you can go away. Uh, I need to put up my electric fences. So that's good to get. The rest of the stuff is all kind of pretty helpful. Did find a good amount of springs, but actually don't set up and get loud, please, Josh. There's a gun safe. There's some boxes to loot. Tier 2 Iron Spear, no thank you. I'll probably actually sell you though, but... Lever Action Quality 3. Bloody bonds are made. That's beautiful for me. I'll scrap you. Working Stiffs box. Another Forger Headbook. Actually, that's another thing I forgot to mention. I did also find enough of those Forger Headbooks. I'm going to make my own cement mixer. Probably means I wasted $7,500 yesterday, but is what it is. Big old bad boy trunk up the top. Art of Mining, 10% more block damage. I'll eat you, take the rest of that, check if anything else is up there, but I think we're ready to go. Make sure I grab that lab equipment box in the bathroom. It's, it's so nice coming back to a place like this. Like, I lived in this bunker back in the Anywhere, Anytime, the gigantic wandering horde mod that, like, basically made this, uh, the game like a Romero mod that Kane made way back when. I lived back in this bunker all the way back then. I had the security cameras. I had the, uh, the alarms. This was my storage room. I love having, like, the flashbacks to places I've lived before, but it was so long ago, and there's no time for nostalgia now, because I am going to be cute coming when the sun comes up to so get back on the bike, get back to my house, and get ready for Horde, because it's really not far away now. Not far at all. I'm real low on fuel, but that's okay. I don't see any demos out here, so I'll cook it just always bang up with some drifty goodness. Whiz bang my little bike back into you. Are you? You do have some gubs in you. I'll take what I can. I'll come back for the rest. I'll scrap you and scrap you, because why not? All right. Up we go. In we go. I've got lots of work to do. If I was having that extra cement mixer, could I make a second one? I mean, I probably could, but I think at the moment, my bigger issue is just my complete lack of stones. It's an issue I've faced before in my life, but this one, hopefully the solution will be easier. I've got to go mining. I was supposed to do that last night, but I went looting instead. So after all that, I've got my generator bank, I've got my battery bank, got four electric fences. That's not really much at all, is it? And some wire relays, a switch. So I've got that stuff. I've got 63 Molotovs. Okay, that gives me a bit of a leg up. I'm excited about that. I've got some pipe bombs. Although I'm looking, other than ammo, other than 762 ammo, I'm looking pretty scant across the board. Sick. Love that for me. Um, What's the plan going to be then? I, I don't even really know what I can do or how I can do or anything about getting this thing sorted. Somehow, in all of that mess out there, I have to build a horde base. I've jumped on the old pedal machine because I'm not going too far. So, like, what's the best way to get stone? It's been so long since I, like, deliberately went out of my way to get stone. I'm not even really sure about it anymore. You give me... Oh, you give me stone and sand. So you're a little... You're a little concrete little nodule. But that's not a bad idea. Maybe I can use that to kind of, like, level out a lot of the world out here. It's all just... It's all just remnants of tarmac anyway. But each one of you that I break is a step closer to more concrete. Hmm, what do I do, though? Like, to use electric fences, I'm going to have to try and funnel the demos in some sort of way. Maybe something like the fist only, like, platform base I built once upon a time. A nice wide path with electric fences on it that they can run through. Because if I get them sizzling, if I get them jiggling, then I can shoot them in the face or throw molotovs at them. But the more condensed they are, the better the molotovs work. Ooh, do I punch? Potentially as a backup, do I punch a hole in this roof here? So when I'm hanging out up the top there, I can throw Molotovs down at dom uh, the demos underneath. Oh, there's a lot of things. There's a lot of things I need to account for. And unfortunately, I'm not a great planner. Trading's actually not far from opening, which is kind of nice for me. I'm getting a good amount of uh, stone and sand out of this as well. In fact, did I mention... It was, there was a lot of things that I unlocked last night. I think I skipped over a whole bunch. I also found the last couple of rifle books I needed. So I can make... It's, ow, a tier three lever action. Oh, thank you. Extra stones are always valuable to me. 
Do I make a tier three lever action? I mean, that's the, without having an extra mod slot in you, you've got three. I don't think a tier three is gonna have. Oh, I'm still thinking of the old way the mod slots used to work before they revamped everything, which, by the way, is a good change. But it means that my habits and my theories were all thrown out the window. Yeah, I think I will. I think at this point I can't really turn down even a slightly better weapon because you never know. At some point I might get lucky and one shot a couple of demos. That would be sick. Let's make this quick, mate, because I have so much to do today. I don't really have the... Oh, I don't have a chance to chat to you about anything. I think in the grand scheme of things, 10 pipe bombs are going to make less of a difference than the potential for some skill mags. So I'll take you. I don't want any jobs from you right now. Assault rifle crafting, knuckles crafting, great, and food crafting. All right, that was completely worthless books, but it is what it is. Nah, not doing it. Not doing it. I mean, I don't have the time nor the desire. If you were going to sell me a fat stack of... Did I check you? I did check you. If you were going to sell me a fat stack of stones, I might be more willing and able, but nah, that's, that's not going to happen, so never bloody mind. I'm on a mission to get some pebbles. I'm not sure how much stone I'm actually going to need. I'm just down in one of the divots getting some extras. But I think after this block here, I reckon that's probably going to be... That's going to do us. That's going to do us for now. I'm going to make some concrete. Get that on the go immediately. I think... Oh, like, I've got Mega Crush. I've been smart. For, I think I've been smart. I've been trying to spec into... I love my bike over there. Um, Trying to spec into cardio and run and gun to try and think that I am going to be moving around pretty considerably, reloading the rifle and trying to avoid contacts. I reckon if I just build like one, one kind of like fighting platform that has the electric fences on it and all that kind of stuff, put that there and then run back to that if I need to, that might be a pretty good way to do it. I mean, it's still not a great plan at all, but it might work out for me. You can go there. I'm going to quickly run back upstairs, get that concrete on the crafts. So I've come out with 1,800 pebbles. I need to turn half of those, I think, into sand, which kind of sucks, but oh well. You. That leaves me... I mean, yeah, look. The, oh, the cement's actually got to run out first. So if I go like you, turn that, crush sand, which is going to be fine. Leave you and them. That's going to work out pretty well. But it's going to take most of the day to get you there. All right, well, in that case, then, I'm going to grab the wood. I'm going to grab... I don't have a lot of cobblestone. I've just used all my stones. Mm, shit. All right, you come with me as well. Then I'm about to make some cobblestone on the fly. Oh, boy. Yep. I mean, actually, I've got a lot of concrete already. I've been buying it like a smart boy, and I didn't even realize it. Oh, well, it's on the craft now, but I actually have more than I thought. My first action is just going to be to upgrade and considerably upgrade, actually, the pillars that hold up the roof of this passing gas. It saved my life last time. It might save my life this time. This is a pretty good investment of my limited resources here. And once I do that, I'm going to build some extra ways to jump on top of this thing so that I can get up there in a pinch nice and quickly. Because if I just have like... Ooh, bonds, mate. More skill points to spend as well. If I just have, like, a kind of a rotation theory, have several little, like, strong points, reinforced areas that I can get to, like, kind of fallback positions. And because they'll, like, they won't take over an area once I'm gone, they'll ignore it. I can potentially use that to my advantage and let them clear out of one place. That's the wrong thing I wanted to click. Let them clear out of one place and get to the next one. Actually, that's right next to a window. That's not what I wanted to do. Let's go... Ooh, let's go like over here, actually. Go like that, down to you. I can make that jump pretty easily with my parkour skills. I want to punch a little hole in the roof. Kind of like directly under that middle pylon, I think. Right about... Yeah, the middle pylon. So if they're beating on the wall there, or if they're beating on the pillars, if it's big enough, I can get some molotovs down there and protect my little investment. I can hear the sound of a zombie dog. Hang on a second. Oh, I've run out of frames. Uh, you... Probably actually paying attention to the zombie dog, Josh. Are you... Are there... Have the zombies respawned in this building? I wouldn't have thought so. 50 blocks out of you, please. Nice and quick, so I can just chuck up the last of this ladder. You... You... Are you... Oh my god, there is two. Alright, uh, well... <laughs> Probably should have reloaded my gun beforehand. Go like that. Call in all your little friends who have all respawned. I mean, I suppose it's been like a good week since I raided this place. They do respawn eventually, but even so, I really thought once I'd cleared the joint, it'd stay cleared. Oh, look at the synchronized swimming on you two as well. Boop, boop. Loot drops to everyone. It's good. 
The rifle's good. It's still in the, the tier two. I forgot to make the tier three when I was home a second ago. How silly. Got another treasure up out of their pockets. Not that I really have time for it right now, but thank you, Nicole. Where have you sent me? On the way to the other trader. All right, well, that's actually not a bad spot at all, to be honest with you. Was there anyone else hanging out in here? Did you drop a loot bag when I murdered you? No, you didn't. I can't open that door either. That's fine. I shouldn't really have to come running through here, I wouldn't think. I'm not really planning on it anyway. I've got the ladders on the outside. I left that loot bag there. That was bloody silly of me, but that's fine. We're all good. Scrap you. Extra ammo. Extra snacks. Okay. I'm going to punch the hole in the roof, and then I'm going to move on to the next thing. I can't get hung up on one thing too much. And I have to get home, actually, and go and make myself the outbreak you first. Uh, and go make myself that C3 lever action. I'm going to need that. So that little hole there is basically perfect for protecting those pillars over there if they group up. I'm not sure how it's going to... Mm, is it going to go well? Can I, I'm throwing a Molotov through a gap that small is fraught with disaster. What about... Actually, what about then? What about then? If that's how it's going to be, I'm going to grab... Copy shape, copy the rotation, and just build myself a couple of little, like, gantries off the side, I suppose. If I get out to there, I can see both sides. So the window in the middle is more for shooting, not for throwing. If I need to throw some stuff, I can get onto the side like that. That's actually a pretty good idea. That's actually a pretty bloody good idea by you, Wordle, for once in your bleeding life. So I can go here, go, oh my god, they're beating down the pillars. Come over to this side, throw a Molotov right there. Smart, smart cricket by you. <laughs> We're actually putting some lessons learned over several years of playing this game. Putting lessons learned into effect and I'm feeling good about it for once. Well, if I'm not throwing anything through this hole, I don't want to risk falling down it. Oh, I mean, I could go... I could go the ladders. Uh, yeah. In fact, no, actually, if I'm just going to be shooting, I don't want the temptation of trying to throw a Molotov through there. So instead, I'm going to put bars in like you. So there's no chance of throwing anything through, but also no chance. If there's only two rungs, I'll leave you as cobble. If there's only two rungs on the ladder, if you hit the rungs, it does stop the bullet. The bars are always uh, penetratable. Sure. Penetrable by bullets. So I'm not going to hit anything. That's looking pretty bloody good, actually. That's actually... That's one of my better ideas. Chunked it together pretty haphazardly, but I think it's gonna work. Nice, I'm gonna go home real fast, make that tier three lever action. Make sure I've got the cement on the craft as well. Might need some extra pebbles as well to make some extra cobblestone to get the upgrade to concrete. All right, it's almost midday, but we're making good tracks. All I need for the lever action is just, ooh, some steel. No, I'm short on steel. After all this time, I've, I've been taking steel for granted because the demos always provide. All right, that sucks. That sucks. You, give me that one though. You're still, mm, you're still cranking out that. Oh, right, hang on. Pause that for a second. Just make me the sand so I can get all the concrete going all at one time. Actually, do I even need you? I don't think I actually need you. I think I'd rather put all those stones towards making the cobblestone because I'm so lacking on the cobble, not the concretes. Yeah, it's definitely the right call. It's definitely the right call. Give me you. Thank you. Make sure I take the, um, what I did have in you into back of my pockets again. You can go. That can all come with me. This can always get chucked into a box. Yeah, that was the right call. I'm surprised I didn't think of that before. At least I caught it before it was too late, though. Well, we're in a pinch, so I'm going to head back to tradies. All the path is nice and clear over here now because I've done some good, some good work clearing it out. Oh my goodness. That's the closest I've ever had. Oh, I'm in a hole. The closest I've ever had an airdrop in my whole bleeding life. 200 meters away? And I'm already on the bike to go and grab it. So yes, bloody please. I'll take you. I'll go to Trady. Hopefully he's going to sell me some steel. I think I needed like 20 or so. Oh, not taking the steel from that last reward. He's coming back to bite me a little bit. If you could fall down just that little bit faster. Can I shoot the parachute? Bring it down quicker. <laughs> come on. I'm right here. Give it to me. I don't even have the time to wait for the drop to come down. So while that's still up in the sky, I'm going to hit up Trady's vending machine. Still no sugar butts. There never bloody is. All right, Knackers. Could I've got lots of money louder. in my pocket and it's you all yours. I don't think that's enough steel. I don't think that's enough steel. Else. Do you have like... Oh, do you have like a tier one drop I'm going to do super quickly? Buried supplies? No, Josh. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you even trying? The, the tier two lever action will get you through the tier three is a luxury. You're giving it your best crack anyway. I don't know. Maybe there's maybe there's some steel in the drop. Swinger about. 
Look at this though. Remember when I planted these trees? Up my driveway when I lived here? Look how good it looks. Look how good it looks. I can't regret moving a house now because that's exactly what I hoped it would look like. That looks so good. That looks so good. It's the little things that make you smile. At least that's what I tell all of my girlfriends. <laughs> oh, potentially anyway. Anyway, you, supply box. What have you got? No steel, but that's okay. I'm going to open you real fast. Oh, a pipe machine gun bundle too. Scrapping books. Forge ahead books. Spear books. And machine gunner books. Okay, that's all right. No steel. That's okay. I was begging. Not choosing. There's a wandering horde of demos trying to beat their way into tradies. I don't think they're going to have an awful lot of luck with that one. But you do have a higher chance of dropping loot bags. Which means, shit shot, you might actually give me some steel. If I get super lucky with it, I could just pop you. Because you're not going to burn traders down. But I could use the extra experience anyway. Boop you. I also don't know if it's just like, if wandering horde zombies die or if I have to actually kill them. What was I, what was I so panicked about the tier three rifle for? Clearly the tier two does enough. Any steel? No. Any steel? No. Can I get that one please? Any steel? Oh, for goodness sake. You guys have been so good with the steel for so long and now you're drying up? Shit. I don't think that was enough but I'm checking anyway. Lever action, it's not enough. It's not enough. I need eight more. Right, okay, you can all go into there then. I've got two random cobblestone blocks. I've got you. Um, most of this stuff needs to get out of my pockets though because this is kind of on me doing nothing. <sighs> I just picked up so much random goo. So much random goo out of those bloody bags that I can't bloody use. And they just weighing me down. I think if I take advantage of these two pillars that are left over from my last horde base, I can try and at least speed up some of the building. Uh, I'm going to need some more frames actually. You're still working away on you, though. I'm going to go... Let's go like a 100 out of you. I don't have an awful lot of wood, which is also a consideration. So even just... Even just trying to build anything at this point is going to be... It's too high, actually. Is going to be a bit sketchy. We'll go like you. I'm not going to build it nearly as tall as last time. I'm going to need to get you out of the way, though. It's made out of wood. I've got my axe in the wrong spot. Get you in there instead. Get you out of the way. So you still got ladders on that side. Mm, I don't... I, ladders are a bit sketchy, though. Because, like, a demo might beat the ladders down. I think a ramp is probably the better way to go. I'll get these all concrete to fight and just have, like... That's a reasonably nice, wide, uh, like, path at the top. I'll put some walls on the sides. So they have to funnel towards me. Three wide. That's a good amount of demos. I can hit them with molotovs, use the electric fences to slow them down and get them all, um... Um... Narrow or fired. What's the fucking word called when you when you group them all together? Um, choke, choke, choke point, choke points at fucking English language. When will I ever learn how to use it? I don't want to use the ladder. So I was too distracted by not being able to talk. And I'm not thinking anymore. Right, you ramps. Don't need to worry too much about anything other than just a nice smooth uh, route up to the top. That's all that I need. It looks a little shoddy, but I don't especially care. I'm using the leftover ladders from last song because they're actually deceptively strong. Oh, I'm going to have to get rid of you though, aren't I? Oh, because yeah, they're going to try and crawl underneath. If I get inside, fuck. If I get inside this little like pocket that I'm leaving in the middle of this ramp, then I'm all screwed anyway. Fortunately, you're pretty fucked up to begin with. I'm still waiting on the last of that cobblestone. You can go like that and actually just start upgrading things. I'm going to need some more wood, aren't I? Wood's going to be my choke point now. Choke? Yeah. It was definitely choke point I was looking for before. But I start thinking about things occasionally they come to me. You can all... Are there any outer facing wall needs to be concrete, I think? Oh, it's already three. It's already three and I've got nothing done. I really wish I had got a nail gun at some point. It would have doubled the amount of upgrading I can do. Even the hammer, it's doubling as fast as the uh, as the stone axe is, but it's still taking way too long for me. This is just to get to the cobblestone as well. This isn't even concrete yet. Actually, come to think of it, do I have... No, I'm not, I'm not even close to getting a nail gun. That's all good. If I come to think of it, I've got three skill points to spend. I'll soon have four. And I actually have some perception goggles back in my back in my sellables chest. So to get up to max level U, I'm gonna need what? Two them. Three there. So uh, I'm gonna be one shy. And then I can use the perception goggles to get to level 10. And then the next two skill points I can go into rifles and into spears. 
Although, given I'm about to use the rifle an awful lot, I reckon that's probably the way to go with it first. <laughs> it's, it's, um, it's looking pretty iffy, isn't it? I'd, like, that will hopefully save me, but I'm not going to rely on it because I'm, uh, I'm everywhere at the moment. Not in a good way. I'm only going to focus on building the things that I can actually build. Like, build, like, the skeleton of the thing first because it still might work at least a little bit and then try to add any flourishes or upgrades or whatever we can later on if we can. You can go to there. That's where... That's where I've reached out to. That's all good. Put, like, a pillar at this end to support it all. That was silly. I could put in... That's not a bad idea. Maybe, like, an extra support pillar in here somewhere just so if there is any accidental explosions like it's all cobblestone so it won't burn down any accidental explosions at least that i can have a chance of keeping things up and going we'll go across like you this is going to be like the nice long catwalk that they've got to trundle down i still need to put in the electric fences somewhere that's how i'm actually going to support them i don't know i want to go i think a little bit further that hay bale is kind of redundant now. We'll go a bit further on. A bit further on. The longer they, I have in front of them, the more I can get headshots. The more I can throw molotovs. The more chance I think I have. It finally happened. It finally happened. I'm out of wood. I need I need some extra splinters. I've got, I've got another bridge that I've built. It wasn't really the plan to start with. I need some way to draw them in two electric fences to throw molotovs at. There's really, there's really no... No good designs. It's either something like this, or I go and try and find... That's not a bad fallback option, actually. There's a couple of, like, remnant buildings over there that I could go and scamper over to. But that one there looks kind of tempting, too. We'll see. We'll see. That could be my third, potentially, maybe not really, fallback position. Because other than just, like, running into a POI, running into, like, a, an inner city building that's nice and strong, and just hoping they don't tear it down around me... There's nothing I can really build that's going to give me the best chance. I can't talk to you unless I'm in the magic square. Here you go. Talk to you. Do you have wood? No. Do you have stone? No. Do you have cobble? I don't think so. No. Do you have a nail gun? No. But I would have given you $14,000 for a nail gun right now, but apparently not. Old mate hates money. It's almost 6 p.m. It's almost 6 p.m. and I haven't even got the floor done yet, let alone like electric fences and stuff. But I think at a basic level, this will still work. Because if I stand down there, they have to. Fuck the thunder starting. I have to, like, they have to run towards me anyway. All that work to try and get concrete, I may not even have time to put it down. I guess I could concrete fire like all the actual like supports. The main catwalk up here doesn't super duper matter, I don't think. Oh, fuck, I wish I had that nail gun so much. I'd be done with the blink if I had that. I'm almost done with just. It's not much, but it's something. Do I want to put like a uh, any sort of cage down here at all to try to protect myself from? I don't have any more building blocks either. Oh, I do have you though. I'll put you down first. Like, yeah, some sort of like... Yeah, I think I will. I think I will. I'm going to go like you. Uh, I'm going to flip you around so you go this way. Just like that, that last line of the fence, I think. There there and then we'll use the rest of the frames to do that one after i make some more time is definitely getting away from me though sure that one that one i don't need much i don't think but this guy i can shoot through this one i can't dickhead i can't throw through this one but if i build like a little thing out to the side then i probably can i definitely can up the top we'll get you uh we'll flip you upside down please yeah, that'll work. You go there, there, and then on this side, do the same again. Like that, and that, and that, so they can't get over the top of it. Nice. And then on the side, we'll just go like you, and we'll go... I mean, okay, yep, that'll work. And then that will work on the other... Damn, fucking hell, Josh. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. I'm doing so bad. Haven't done any concrete yet, so this is going to be the first ones, because this is going to be like... If I, everything goes wrong, I need something to stop the demos just punching me in the face immediately. This is a tried and true method to keep me just a little bit safe. You guys all across there as well, getting lots of experience. Mm, I mean, that's... Yeah, that's enough space. That's enough space to throw some Molotovs out there. Got some ladders on the back as well to make sure I have a way up here. Just cobblestone will do on you, I think. Probably need to make that, that outside little pillar uh, concrete, but oh well, too late. Okay, I need to build... What's the most important thing? I need to build the, the pylons to run the electric fences. I've got four. So we'll go... Huh, you, get out of the way, please. We'll go like this. In fact, I need to make a thing... Whoa, oh, pillar. I need, to, I need to make something small enough that the zombies won't try and break it down. You, 0.025 centered. 
Yeah, okay. That looks nice and thin. I don't think the zombie should attack that. We'll go up to you. We'll go this one and go... Oh, but you, you, that's a switch. That's a switch, Josh. You, absolute alarm. That one, wind your face in the right way, please. Hup. Nice. Okay, that'll do. That's tall enough to get the wire going across the, the pathway. Although what I didn't anticipate is how far I can actually reach with that. Oh, I hope I can reach it. It's already after eight. Oh my goodness, I'm an idiot. I didn't even bring my wire tool. I didn't... Oh, I've got to go back to the house anyway. I didn't even bring my wire tool. I didn't even upgrade any of these to concrete. Can I go like, just real quick, just like the central columns? I've got to go home. I've got to get my molotovs. I've got to get my ammo. I've got to get the wire tool while I'm there. I've still got the electronics on me, so I might be able to wire it up nice and quick. I've got five skill points to spend. When I, oh, that's going to be enough, actually. When I get those perception goggles, I'm going to start leveling up into rifles even more so. You just go like that. I mean, look, it's not much. If a demo pops, it's all fucked anyway, but that might keep me alive for a little bit. Oh, my God, just go. Oh, my God, just go. Oh, I don't have time. I don't have time. I need things to repair things with. I'll take you and you. Nothing else there really shouts that I need you right now. I'll take that. Um... Switches are back to basically later. I've got... Oh, my God, i got to go. Oh, my God, i got to go. All right, up, over, out. I've got to run my electricity immediately, if not sooner. Down to the hedges. Save your ankles. In fact, I'm going to pop a Mega Crush now to make me extra speedy while I'm trying to run this shit. Where am I going to put it? Where's where's a good... Trader's clothes. I don't know where to put it. Um, None of these places are really a good, a good spot. I'm going to put it there. Which is not ideal, but okay. You, can I reach it, please? Go to that one. Fucking beautiful. You to them. You to them. And then you to there, because that gives me three lines of electric fence. Nice. Good. Interact with you. That one. That one. Um, Refuel. Turn on. And it's as good as we're going to get. That's as good as we're going to get. You can get out of the way, out of the way, and grab you, you, and all of those ones instead. All right. Well... <laughs> It is what it is. We've made it through. Why are they on? Why are they on? Why didn't that work? Why didn't that work? What? What the fuck? Oh my god, they come to the backside as well. Why didn't... You are fucking shitting me. They've immediately broken the backside of my little, um, of my little uh, catwalk. It's immediately gone to tits. Why didn't my electric fences work? The lights are on. Why? Why? What? Why? Um, okay. That's a bigger problem that I wanted immediately off the bat. I'm going to quickly run to my backup. My backup's happened 15 seconds into the horde. You guys can quickly cop all of that because I need to quickly spend a couple of skill points. Perception, you, you. It's going to give me level 10. Dead eye. I need one more point. I need one more point. So if you guys could quickly die, that would be wonderful. Why didn't the base work? Why didn't the base work? There's no reason why it shouldn't have worked. Can you stop beating through my ladders, please? I need to figure that out. They're already breaking this joint, though. I'm going to get out of here while they burn to death behind me. Why didn't that work? Thank God I concretified a little bit. Oh, my God. You've already broken that one, too. Let's get that out of the way. Um, I've got no idea why that hasn't worked. You're powered. You're on. You're on the right level. Is it too low? Is it because it's, like, actually on the ground rather than... It might be, you know. It might bloody be, you know. Oh, well, well, I've got... I need a, that's another skill point to get max level. Oh, my God. Max level on my rifles. If you crouch, come under. I'm in some trouble. Don't bother aiming. I'm hitting the... Remember what I was saying about the bars at the bloody passing gas? If you hit the bars, it stops the bullet. Well, I put bar, I put the, the bloody ladders in and it's stopping bullets. Oh, yeah, that's... um. This is a thing. This is a thing. This is a big thing. Hup. Huh? Throw that while I jump off the back. They've broken through those. Now you're fucking working. You're having a laugh game. You're having a fucking laugh. They've broken through those pillars heckin' quickly. I'm not sure where they're trying to get through now, but it's definitely... I'm oh, trying to undermine the building. I need that next level up. Oh, that was a fucking good pill. Need that next level up so I can get that last level of dead eye. That's going to save my life quite good. Uh, quite good? Quite well, I think. But well, you guys are there. Do I have any wood on me? I don't think I do. Okay, here's the plan. Here's the plan. Get to home where I'm inside like the crafting radius. I need a couple of frames so I can rebuild. Up we go. So I can rebuild. Sure, uh, the um the ladders on my uh my horde base over here. You guys are all pissed off about that lamppost. Fair enough then. Get your burning while you run through it. 
Go faster, go faster, go faster. I'm doing repairs and rebuilds in the middle of a horde. I don't want the ladders again. I love the ladders, but not right now. You go then. You go then. Come on, quickly, quickly. Don't panic and overscroll. I don't have the wood. I don't have the wood. Of course I don't have the fucking wood, Josh. Mm, shit. Right. Should have thought of that ahead of time. Can't do the upgrades. Can't do the repairs. But I don't have wood on me. But you know what? Uh, who, who wants their nipple tickled? You do. There you go. Enjoy that. I'm going to run away. Get some chain reactions going. Chuck in another mega crush. Oh, I am... I don't, I don't have any tools to get any wood either. All right. <laughs> there is a lot of problems going on right now. Maybe I scrapped the last of those frames. I might be able to get the wood that I need. Did they break the frames though? They broke one of the frames. Okay. You. Go like that. That's not enough though. I need eight. I need eight. Eight per bloody block. Yeah, that's a problem. I don't think I can do it. I don't think that's going to be an option. I think my main thing here is just going to have to be to keep on moving between them to try and stop them destroying the entire thing. There goes the roof. There goes the roof of my uh, of my backup plan. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, they got closer. That's why I don't like my peripherals getting cooked by the bloody scope. Um, I don't think it's time to go to you again. I am faster than the demos, which is nice. So fight you guys, because you guys are the ones closest to me. But if I use my super duper speed with my parkour and my running gun, I might be able to just kind of group these guys up, start tickling nips and let them kill each other. I mean, look, I'd love the extra experience. I really would. But at this point, I'm more just interested in surviving. Nice. That actually, oh, that actually killed a few of them. I've got no points in machine guns. That's, that's all I can do there is kill me with explosions. Oh, come through the craters. Come through the craters. It's been two hours. It's been two hours. I'm in so much, so much trouble. You're gone. I, I killed one of them at least. We're edging. We're edging ever closer to getting ourselves the next level up. One of them has hit a bloody vending machine, it looks like. Yeah, he has, you bloody pelican. There you go. Cop that. You can get electrified and burn all of it. There's a lot of them in front of me. Hold on. Hold on. In fact, can I... If you're all grouped up there, can I use that? Get... Oh, that's, that last pillar's almost gone. You give me a little window to throw through. Appreciate that. I'm going to line the path with fire. And draw them all through it. And pop some heads if I can on the way through. Oh, yep, there goes that last block. Time to go. Time to very much... Shit. <laughs> Time to very much go. This couldn't be going much worse right now. Thank God I built a backup plan. It's very quickly become my only plan. You need to die if I can... There we go. Some extra XP out of you. We're getting closer and closer. I think the trick is here to let them burn to death and not, like, not let them explode because the mortal do a fair amount of damage. So if I can just give him a little tickle, get the health down a little bit, get a bit of distance. I've spent all that resource in to make myself the Molotovs. So I should probably actually use them. Over we go. It's just a scramble. It's a scramble for my life. Thank God I'm fast with the Mega Crush. Missed it. Oh, missed it again. <laughs> I may be fast, but I'm still shit. I think the collapse, yeah, did. The collapse of my little bunker over there has led to the destruction of my generator. So, well, if I was worried about that the electric fence is not working before, they're definitely not working now. What a stitch up that was. I don't know. Was it just too low? Was it just too low in the ground? And that's why they didn't actually turn on. Because that, that was the start of my problem. Was I hear a bloody dog. It's been a little while since I had to fight some zombie dogs in a horde. There you are. You're gone. You sound like a tire fighter. Someone pointed out that the demo sounded like an angry cow. And now I can't unhear it. Hold on. Just take, this, at head height, just take pot shots and hope for the best. That's, that's all I'm really doing. Oh my god, thank god for Mega Crush. Mega Crush OP. Although I think I've just wasted the rest of it. Get you going. Uh, that one nice and fast. Get off the edge. <laughs> that was tight. Had to get rid of you. Chuck you in instead. Bonza, mate. Got that level up. Wonderful. Put that right up the guts of you there. Gonna put that last point into my rifles. Up we go. Yoom. That one. Perception. Dead eye. Max you out. Oh, they're all coming. They're all coming. There's not much left of anything. I'm not sure what they're trying to break down anymore, but they're kind of everywhere in there. Have another Molotov just like that. Make sure all... Oh, God. <laughs> they're, they're taking down the pillars. That Oh, the pillars are this side of going too. I don't know what is holding this joint up, but thankfully it seems to be something... You can go right then. No way! No way! I hit him on the nip! I COVID his nipple with a Molotov! 
That was bad. All right, well, now the building is burning down. Even though it was throwing Molotovs like a happy little Galara a second ago. Got punched in the face a little bit. That's now a bit of a bigger problem. Hopefully that passing guy stays standing because otherwise I'm going to be in all sorts of trouble. Oh, oh, you. You're made of stone. Up, you get. Oh, my God, what a clutch jump that was. Uh, I'm going to step away from where my actual base is. Though. We can all come over to this side. This <laughs> is... An absolute shambles. This is an absolute disaster. I'm trying to get a nice little lineup going. I do have that last point in Dead Eye that I want to take advantage of. Oh, that's not the way to do it. Oh, thank God I'm a speedy boy. Oh, okay. That was dangerously close to my home as well. Use the Dead Eye. Oh. <laughs> if I didn't have the Mega Crush now, I would have died so long ago. Mega Crush OP. I shouldn't say that loud because it will get nerfed. How much time have I got? I've got 12 more minutes of speedy, boys. That's good. My hydration's up. It's just the sprinting away. Then the aiming down the sides is cooking my stamina. Good. That was the last round. I'd love if I could put like that extended tube mag mod onto the rifle, but you can't for some reason. Gone. Gone. Not quite gone. Oh, let's run around the pond. G'day, knackers. In fact, you know what? It's been a little while. Stat. <laughs> Clearly not the ideal plan for Tanopi. You no, know, we had to get the spear involved. Oh my goodness, Josh, learn how to aim, please. I've gone back up my little ramp. They're all burning rather nicely. I've got five rounds. Wait for it. There you are. Nice. I don't want to break down the pillars underneath me, but hopefully five rounds means five kills. Oh, quickly reload. No, they're, def they're definitely beating on shit. They're definitely beating on shit. Chuck a molly and go. Got an hour and a half to go. An hour and a half to go. The moon is getting low on. Get back up onto the roof for this joint. <laughs> oh, I missed the jump. I missed the jump. Shit. Fuck. I forgot to account for me being a fucking idiot. There we go. Extra ladders. Turns out I did account for me being a fucking idiot. Just drop that right off the edge. Cop that. No more nipple play, please. Now's not the time. We can do that later if we really need to. But if we don't have a horde base, can't play with anything. I need to get a little bit of a break here, so... I could just... Oh, oh, there we go. I was going to say, I'm putting more bullets into you than holes in a sponge, but somehow you're still not getting tickled about it. Try again. Better. I'd love some chain reactions right about now, please. Beautiful. It's burning down something, but that's... That's someone else's problem, not mine. Someone called the fire brigade, not me. Good shooting text. No one's coming up behind me. You're looking... Oh, you were very close. You're looking very bloody upset with me. Over we go. 12, 40 more minutes. 40 more minutes. If that's a good shot for a Molotov. Right. Oh, yeah. I hit him. I hit him. Of course I bloody did. Give it a moment to get your stamina back. That's my main concern right now. I mean, I am still mega crush. I'm just not overhydrated anymore. Probably should put some points into, like, Iron Gut or something to try and keep my stamina going. Got a ladder on this side. Last stamina. Oh! Oh, I almost missed it. I almost missed it. All right, get on top. Get your breath. <laughs> this has been awful. I'm just going to let them burn. Let them burn for the next 20 minutes because, well, after that, then I can just clear up whoever's left and not really have to worry too much about it. I'd rather... I accidentally shot because I panicked because I heard collapsing happening. So as they, right, as they destroy the supports over there, the span over here gets weaker and weaker. Smart, smart bloody demos. Their structure engineering degrees are coming to the fore. You can go away. I don't have a scoop to spend again yet. You're gone. But do I? Uh, you? No, I don't. But I'm still 10 out of 10. Shit! 10 out of 10 perception. They broke it down. They broke it down. Clever girl. Chuck in the first aid bando. I'm going to get back up onto you to get my stamina back up again. Don't waste another mecha crush. Don't waste another mecha crush. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Seven more minutes. There's the morning. There's the morning. We made it through. We made it through. Look how slow and docile you are now. With your big doe eyes. Oh, you're all fucked. <laughs> you had you had the upper hand for six hours. Now it's my time to shine. You're all weakened. Look at that. You're all weakened. And with my max level rifles and spears to boots. Ah, oh, look at him. Look at him. The poor little wiggly worm. I'd feel bad for you if you didn't just ruin all of my nights. All right. We're alive. If I thought the first Horde night was a disaster, that one was well, maybe a shade above. It was still a disaster, but not quite as a surprising disaster as the first one was. I'm alive somehow. Uh, my Horde base didn't work. Electric fences didn't work. Backup plan 
kind of did work actually for most of the night and it's all falling apart now so i have no idea what i'm gonna do for the next one because there actually is gonna be a next one i did say like a week ago that i only ever really intended for this series to go for one week but now now that i'm actually playing it i thought it would be basically suicide to begin with but now that i'm playing it i'm having so much fun with it and also you guys are enjoying this series as well which i super duper appreciate you guys are excited about it i'm excited about it so we're gonna go longer again but to in keep with like the theme of what i've been doing with this i have a plan to turn this up so much worse for the next week that i may actually go overboard with it it's gonna be on a whole other level of cooked I'm not going to spoil what it's going to be. You're going to have to see what I'm talking about in the beginning of the next episode. But I'm also going to turn up um, zombie speeds and zombie difficulties. I'm not going to turn them up to insane difficulty. Bullet sponges are just no fun, but I'm definitely more potent than I was expecting me to be at this point with the lever action. So got to turn up the difficulty and the speed a bit as well to balance it and really see how bad this can all get. But... You're going to have to see how bad, it is, how bad it is and what I've got in store for you in the next episode because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you liked, make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. I'm going to talk to you there first. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.